tastes like butter in your mouth. No. <laughs> so weird, I don't even know what to say. Okay, so this week in the life vlog has proved to be a lot different for me to film than the one I did for college. Um, basically, I just work all the time. Like, it's literally like 8.30 right now, 8.30 p.m. I woke up at like 8, took a shower, made breakfast, got ready for work, went to work, worked for eight and a half hours, obviously couldn't film while I was there, couldn't film backstage, it was just, you know, all that stuff. I said yesterday that I was thinking about going to Animal Kingdom after I got off work, or maybe Disney Springs, but then when I was looking at the wait times, I was, I had been watching them all day. Um, Epcot seems to be the park with the least amount of crowds, and it's open the latest, so I figured I would just take the Skyliner over here from work, which is what I did, and I am now in Epcot in the World Showcase. I'm gonna go grab some dinner from the, I was about to call it Food and Wine. It's the same booths, but it's Festival of the Holidays now, and it is Tuesday, I think. You will learn as a CP that you never know what day of the work it <laughs> do the work. Yeah, ex yes, that day of the week, day of the work, yes, honestly. Yeah, I'm gonna go get some dinner from the American Pavilion because they've got this turkey dinner for Festival of the Holidays. It is amazing and I'm so hungry, so ready to eat. I forgot to mention that it is now Tuesday, December 24th. Happy Christmas Eve. Um, yeah, oh, and uh, work, was, work was good. I was in Beverly Sunset. Oh my gosh, it is so bright. I was in Beverly Sunset Boutique for eight and a half hours. They didn't switch me, they didn't rotate me between Beverly and once, which is really weird but you know i went with it beverly is our pixar store so i was just talking toy story and incredibles and up and all the pixar movies you can think of it was a lot of fun so part of the reason that i chose to come to epcot the main reason was the crowds because animal kingdom flight of passage was a four hour wait yeah i know that sounds absurd 285 that is over four hours i believe um everest was 135 and Dinosaur was 70. That was the wait times last I checked. But also I have very I have four very specific things that I want to do while I'm here in Epcot. That is eat the turkey dinner, grab some caramel corn from the Germany Pavilion, ride Spaceship Earth, and they just released a new Epcot Spirit jersey, I think. So I'm gonna see if I can find that because I love Epcot and I need everything Epcot. So give me the spirit jersey. <laughs> candlelight processional is going the whole time I was eating and they're still going. They sound incredible and they are distracting me. I'm such a music person like I just want to stand there and watch them and like listen to them but I mean I have an agenda. I have things to do and I'm not I don't think I'm gonna get on a spaceship earth at this rate which is okay because I still I have my two days off I'm trying to get to both Daki and, and uh, Daki and Animal Kingdom. Yes. No I'm trying to get to both Dak and Epcot on my days off so that I can say my final goodbyes to those two. I love the World Showcase. It's just so well themed. It's just beautiful. Like Italy, it reminds me, I went to Real Italy like two years ago. I went twice, but I went to Real Venice about two years ago and it was just, it totally captures the essence of Italy in that pavilion. It's just beautiful. Oh, I love it. So I'm here to show you guys my guilty pleasure when it comes to Epcot, which I only found about halfway through my program. I've only ever gotten once because it's probably so bad for me, but that is the uh, caramel corn from Germany. It tastes like butter in your mouth. No. <laughs> so weird. I don't even know what to say. Plus, it's like super cute in here. Like, look at this. It's all decorated for Christmas. I love the Germany Pavilion. <laughs> you can also watch them making all the treats like live. This is so cool. I got it, and it's amazing. Well, I got my uh, spirit jersey. All's good. But now I am gonna ride test track because the single rider. Oh my god, my hair. Single rider line is. Which is amazing. I don't even know if it's worth it. 
it's like 15 minutes mind bar. Well, it took like half an hour to get on the test track, which the sign lied, it said 15 minutes, but whatever, it's fine. Um, I'm gonna run my mouse gear because Kylie wants a pair of ears, so I might grab those for her if they have them. We'll see if they have them. Um, and then I'm gonna head out because I've got to clothes, except for extra magic hours, but I'm not staying in a resort hotel, so I can't stay for extra magic hours. Bummer. Okay, I got her ears. That was super easy. Mouse care had them right there and there's no line, which is surprising. Alrighty, so I'm going going back to my apartment now. I'm gonna take the CP bus home. Uh, I have no idea when the next one's supposed to be coming, so yeah, I gotta put the phone away because I'm about to head backstage, but I will see you guys whenever I get back to the apartment. Bye! I am home and I changed into my Epcot spirit jersey that I just bought, which is fun. I also have my retainer and so uh, yeah. I'm gonna head to bed because I have an early morning tomorrow. I am gonna go have brunch with Stacy, my Florida mom, which if you guys watched my previous vlogs of moving to Florida and then move in day, you got to meet her there. So I'm doing Christmas morning with her and her family, then working from two to nine, and then um, some of my coworkers are having like a movie night. So I think I'm gonna go to that too, which is hopefully gonna be really fun. Uh, it's gonna be a busy day tomorrow, but it's good because I won't hopefully be missing home. So, yeah. Anyway, Merry Christmas Eve and good night.